the positive integers between 200 and 300 inclusive are not divisible by 2, 3, or 5. Okay, so again, it's, it says not divisible by. We're going to get the ones that are divisible by 2, 3, or 5, and then just do um, 101 minus that because 200 to 300 is 101 inclusive or total, total terms. So remember the formula, the greatest minus the least over 1. So this is nothing, plus 1. So it's 101 total terms from 200 to 300. So first of all, we have to get the multiples of 2. So the greatest is 300. My least is 200 over 2 plus 1. Excuse me. Uh, 51. The multiples of 3. 300 is the greatest. 200 is not a multiple of, of uh, 3, but 201 is. So I squeeze into that like I talk about. Plus 1, that gives me 34. The multiples of 5, okay, so it's 300 is the greatest, 200 is the least, over 5 plus 1. Um, that gives me uh, 21. Okay, so I add up all those, that's 106. Now I need to get the double count, and I have to get every version of the double count. Okay. So I need to get the multiples of, of 2 and 3 first, that double count, then 2 and 5. Then three and five. Okay, so this is going to be three hundred is the greatest. Two hundred one is not a multiple of six, but two hundred four is. Minus six plus one should give me seventeen. Three hundred minus two hundred over ten plus one gives me eleven. Three hundred minus two hundred one is a multiple of three, but not a five. Two hundred four, two hundred seven, two ten. Seven. So that gives me 35. Now, I need to get every version of overlap. So now I need to get the multiples of all of them, 2, 3, and 5. In other words, the multiples of 30. Sorry, this is small. So basically, I do the formula 300 minus 210 over 30 plus 1 gives me 4. Okay, so I have 106, 35, and 4. Now, um, so what do I need to do? I need to start with the total, 106, then I need to take off the double count of 35. But th those one multiples of all three, those four multiples of 30, those have been counted three times, and then they've been subtracted three times, actually. So I actually need to add them back in, okay? Because they've been counted three times, and they got subtracted three times. Um, so that's 31 or 71 uh, plus 4 is 75. Not 76, that's 75. So as a last step, I do 101 minus 75 gives me 26.